Yesterday, Tom Hanks released a brand new iPad application called Hanks. The app turns your iPad into a typewriter. If you've never wanted that, that's okay, but everyone else apparently really has. The app is now the single most popular iPad app in the United States. So the app does about what you expected it to do. It sounds like a typewriter. You can click along here. This is the spacebar sound effect. It's quite different. And the return sounds quite nice. So yeah. And then as you go along, you can reach the end of a section, as I can do right here quickly. And it makes a nice ding sound usually. But as you can see, it's a pretty basic editor. You can't do too much with it. You can go over to numbers here and so forth, but it's not that diverse of an option or array. But there are some little tweaks that are quite fun. You can turn off modern delete, for example. And as you can see here, when you type, and then try to backspace, you get little X marks, and then they kind of scoot along there. So it's something akin to a typewriter experience, but that's really annoying to type on, so I recommend turning that off. You can even actually turn off the cursor, and then you can't see it all where you are on the page until you type. So you have to think very quickly. If you have both modern delete off and the cursor gone, it's quite difficult. Now, the app does other things as well. You can actually, ironically, email and message out your typewriter, app, your typewriter notes, and uh, you can go back and delete and start with blank pages and so forth, but, Got rid of that, there we go. Uh, most fun, perhaps, is the ability to change typewriters. Now, I haven't bought them yet, but here's another option inside the app itself. Um, different colors, different sound effects even, and there is one more that I'll show you, which is right back here. Scroll over, and yes, the Golden Touch by Hanks. Um, this one's a little gaudy. It looks like a bad LA nightclub writ large, um, but it types along just fine. Uh, you only get one typewriter for free as part of the application itself, but you know, if you really wanted to have a typewriter experience on your iPad, this does uh, quite fit the ticket. So should you download the application? Well, it is free, it is fun, and it is endorsed by Tom Hanks. So it's hard to say no to the entire thing. It may not fit your specific workflow. You may need a more fully featured application and maybe something a little less whimsical, but maybe for typing a letter, typing an email, it could be a fun way to approach typing on your iPad.